checkmate. Don't get sore, Major. You taught me. Lieutenant, I'm Major Randley. Lieutenant Hanley. Sit down. Make yourself at home. Thanks. Where did you lose your outfit? You can talk, Lieutenant. They've run out of hidden microphones. Hello, Hanley. Frost? Small world, huh? We're all POWs. You can talk. This is Captain Todd. How do you do? Hi. Lieutenant Carruthers? Nice to know you, Lieutenant. Hi. Lieutenant Mables? How do you do? Lieutenant? Hardly worth an introduction. He's leaving tomorrow. Leaving? Escape? Look, you just got here. You haven't even tried the coffee. Well, listen, Major. I've got some important information if I can get out of here. Sure, sure. Everybody's got a reason to get out of here. But everybody takes his turn. You might just as well try the coffee. Now, listen to me, Major. We had an accident with another truck on the way in here. A truck coming out of a factory loaded with ball bearings. And that truck was only one in a long convoy. I'm sure the factory's in full production. But it's so well hidden... The Air Force hasn't even found it yet. Now, before they buttoned us up, I fixed three landmarks in my mind. I'm positive I can pinpoint it from aerial maps. I see. Hit on a ball bearing factory. That could be something. He is about your size, Maples. His mission is important. I have a brilliant idea. Why doesn't he go in my place? I'd buy it. Now, wait a minute. Don't the Germans have anything to say about that? Oh, getting out, escape isn't too hard. That's what comes after. Evasion, that's the tough part. You'll have to cross Germany and German-occupied France. Jason. And Vic Morrow. Guest star, Lloyd Bachner. What's wrong, the die again? No, the ink is good this time. It's the buttons. I'm not exactly sure where they should be. 
Who is? That's why we chose Albania. It's part of the Axis. But very few Germans will have seen an Albanian uniform, let alone counted the buttons. Well, I'm not worried about the uniform, but what do I do about all the languages I don't know? Uh, use this letter. It identifies you as Lieutenant Vlora, Albanian liaison officer who speaks no German or French, and requests assistance from all authorities. Now, I'm endorsing it by the German Foreign Office, the German War Department, the German Passport Section, the German Home Guard, and I'm thinking about the German Widows and Orphans Pension Fund. How do you say Albanian in German? Albanian, but rely on the letter. We've learned a few things. Don't count on help from the civilians, not even the French. If they're caught helping you, they'll be killed. Letter of introduction, Albanian orders, Betermacht endorsement, identity card, visitor's pass. Beautiful. Who did those, Mabels? Well, there's a chap on the third floor. He worked for the Bank of England. Ah. Well, this is how it goes. We have access to a room that opens up over the river. You make your way downstream till you come to... By the way, you can swim. Will I get the chance? I think so. Only one guard patrols that side of the castle. He won't start you out till he's got his back to you. What about the uniform? Won't, won't the water ruin it? You won't be wearing it in the water. You'll carry an oil skin change later. Now, as I was saying, you swim down the river till you get to a bridge. Get out there. Make your way north till you come to a railroad station. You can get a train there for Viden. W-E-I-D-E-N, Viden. Got it? Yeah, when do I go? This afternoon. In broad daylight? We can't get to the room over the river at night. How does it sound? You believe it? It won't work if you don't believe it. I believe it.
Sensi, bitte. Ja. Weiden. Welche Flasche? Weiden. Weiden. Wollen Sie dritte oder zweite Flasche fahren? Herr Major. Hände hoch! Die Hände über den Kopf! Nimm ihn mit! Vorwärts! Marsch! Das ist alles. Wein. Ja, Schluck. Von welcher Abteilung bist denn du? Hm? Von welcher Abteilung kommst du? Nicht Deutsch. Nichts Deutsch. Ja. Uniform. Was ist das für eine Uniform? Albanien. Albanien?
Was ist die italienische Marine? Nein. Rumänische? Nein. Ich kenne diese Uniform nicht. Komm, fragen wir ihn. Heil Hitler! Heil Hitler! Herr, wir haben uns gewundert, was es für eine Uniform ist. Ihr Uniform? Was ist es? Albanien. Albanien. Dankeschön. Albanien. Dankeschön. Das ist nicht dasselbe. Siehst du? Das ist nicht dasselbe. Zwei Reihen von Knöpfen. Herr Major, dieser Mann sagt, der ist albanisch, aber seine Uniform ist nicht die richtige. Sehen Sie? Bleibt hier. Ich erledige das schon. Ihre Papiere, bitte. Ihre Kennkarte. Soldat, kommen Sie her. Dieser Mann ist verhaftet. Nehmen Sie ihn mit. Jawohl, Major. Gut gemacht. Let it back, lend a hand. Never do to leave this sort of thing lying around. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Those Hitler youth are a fight. Bad luck you ran into one whose hobby's uniforms. That's good work you're wearing. Hempstead Prison, I'd say. Oh, look, old chap, I can't blame you for being cautious. You've been properly warned, I'm sure, but there simply isn't time. I'm trying to get out of the country myself. Only the uniform is Wehrmacht. The rest of me is straight from Piccadilly. Name is Thorne. Hanley, American. Thanks for the help. A pleasure. Well, shall we go? Go? Go where? You can't get back on the train. Well, we can drive. Where are you going to get a car? Well, steal one, of course. Where else? One stop first. There's a remarkable sausage shop in this town. If wars were fought with sausage instead of bullets, the Germans would rather well rule the world. It's the last chance for a nibble. Eight hours of nibbling is all I can take. Well, if you insist. Oh, by the way, we're coming to a checkpoint up ahead. Where we show our papers? Mm. If it gets critical, we make a run for it. 
Ihre Ausweise bitte. Er ist albanisch. Ach so, in Ordnung. Germany in a stolen car, and he says, relax. We're in France now. Same thing. Well, look at it this way. Country's beautiful. And uh, we're only 12 miles from the Allied lines. How do you know so much about this escape business? Well, it's a long story, but a very interesting one. I was with the RAF, shot down over France two years ago, wounded and all that. The Jerry's would have had me, but the underground snatched me first. It took them several months to nurse me back together again. When I got back home, I couldn't get those people. I kept seeing them moving through the dark, risking their lives for us, giving us their rations when they were hungry. I just couldn't get them out of my mind. So I asked for permission to come back and work with them. And here I am. What are you doing in Germany in a major's uniform? You're lucky it was my size, eh? The Gestapo intercepted my contact. Tortured my real identity out I was on my way when I spotted you. The well, chances are they're looking for you harder than they are for me. Yes, I'm sure of it. By the way, if there's a mix, don't get confused on your loyalties. In the last ditch, it's every man for himself. A sentiment has killed more than one amateur. How'd you like to drive for a while, old man? almost out of gas. Yes, I know. There's enough to get us to the next town, though. By the way, there's a wonderful cafe there. Open air. Perfect for a spot of lunch. Lunch? Is that all you ever think about? Well, we must keep up our strength, old boy. Brazen it out, huh? Keep up morale. The morale is often the difference between a prisoner and a free man. This cafe. Everyone from the mayor to the German high command is there. Well, they'd hardly look for two fugitives in a place like that. Precisely. Bonjour, merci. Vous avez fait vos choix? Euh, oui. Des cœurs d'artichaut avec foie gras. Une soupe à l'oignon. Poulet en sauce d'ail. Euh, les petits pois avec les oignons doux. 
Une salade et une bouteille de Pinot Blanc. Du Pinot Blanc, c'est parfait. Mon ami Albania veut la même chose. You know we could get ourselves killed. What a way to die. Impossible. What? An Albanian, a real one. Duck, drop something. The Gestapo will be very happy to give you a place to stay. Both of you. An Englishman and an American. That is very interesting. Obviously you were not looking for me. Hmm? Oh, forgive me. Kopke, Gestapo. What is your uniform supposed to be? It's not Romanian, not Bulgarian, Albanian, eh? It's unimportant. But you, your uniform, where did you get it? Oh, there's a slight uh, mix-up at the tailor shop. Insolent. You murdered to get it. The oh. Hello? Ne quittez pas. C'est pour toi, Hans. Move. Quickly. Ja. Ja, ja, ich hab sie hier. Ein Amerikaner und ein... Sie sind geflüchtet. Alle Personen nach Ihnen suchen.
Get out of here. Hey, don't you hear me? I said, get out. I will scream. I will scream. No, you won't scream. You'd have done it by now. What do you want? The Englishman. I don't know anything about him. What happened to him? I don't know, I tell you. Is he dead? Did they catch him? Now you know what happened to him. Your boyfriend talks to you. You know every move the Gestapo makes. If you leave now, I won't tell her Kopke that you are here. I didn't ask for any part of this. You asked for it when you accepted Kopke. I accepted food when there was no food. And a place to stay when there was no place to stay. I accepted survival. Why don't you leave me alone? There's more to it than just survival. No. I'm still alive. I feel nothing. I take no sides. Then why didn't you scream? I was afraid you'd kill me if I did. You weren't frightened when you watched me escape. And you still didn't warn Kopka. Now where's Thorne, the Englishman? He's hiding. Then he did get away. He was wounded. How do you know? I saw. He kept running, but he was badly hurt. He got as far as that warehouse. They must have searched it. I wonder if he's still in there. I don't know. Two of Popke's men went through it. They didn't find him. Maybe he's still there. I didn't see him leave. He's coming. He's coming up. Go. Go this way. Hurry. C'est mon apéritif. Hein? L'Américain 
et l'anglais avant demain matin. Un autre, s'il te plaît. The whole flat of Why didn't you answer me? Oh, I must have passed out. It's comfortable, you know. It started getting cold. Cold? Come on, let's have a look. All right, better get you out of here with me. Sentimental, that's what you are. Well, if you had half as much brains as you have courage, you'd be home by now. All right, come on. Let's go. No, 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 no. no I've, I've lain up here on these sacks, feeling my life dipped down between them for hours. It just wouldn't stop. Not much left, I'm afraid. All right, go on, we're going. to go on, old man. I got money and a map. We'll steal another car and no, bribe somebody to drive us. No, no, it's no good. No, the river. The river? The river, that's the ticket now. A barge. Early tomorrow morning, we float downstream. Straight through to our own line. All right. The river it is. Give it up, Henley. Go on, get out. Go on. Now listen, I'm going to the river and you're going with me. I don't think so. She told me the truth after all. Fool. He can't walk. He won't have to. I'm not taking you any place. You won't spread the word that my own woman helped you to escape. It will end right here. Uh. Uh. Oh. Oh.
Let's go. No, I belong here. I will be all right. Nobody will know. As he said, it ends right here. What will you do? Another cup? I hope not. 